Hi, this is Mel Sol with the July golf tip and uh, once again we're going to talk about putting. Uh, Lisa Train of Calgary, Alberta had sent me an email to a link where someone was talking about putting cross-handed and the importance of the right hand in that process and uh, she couldn't quite get a handle on it and so I decided to do a video to make it clear for her and I think it's a, a very very good way to putt if you're not a good putter. Um, if you want to stand there and just make solid putting strokes over and over again uh, cross-handed is a really good way to go because there's very little breakdown in that wrist that happens with a lot of people with putting. Uh, and the key to it is in your right hand, so let me explain that to you. First of all, to take your putter and just take it to the as if you were doing a full swing there, just with your right hand, and you'll see at the top of the swing you get into what I call the tray position, and you've got that right wrist cupped. Now, in the, from that position, I want you to bring the club down and keep that cupped position. So all the way down you just maintain that cup position until you get down to the address position. Now put your left hand on below maintaining that cup position. What you'll see is now I've got quite a severe angle between this forearm here and the shaft and that's gonna lock that wrist in place and the left arm is just hanging straight down and the back the key here the back of the left wrist is very flat this gives almost like a piston motion to the putting stroke and you can see when i do my practice swings here i'm going backwards and forwards not really pushing or pulling with left hand or right hand still working my shoulders but the configuration of the grip this way prevents any breakdown and you can see as the putter face is going backwards and forwards going back and through putter face is staying very very square so when I go up to the ball now you're gonna hold putts over and over again with a very very repeatable putting motion let me show you from behind so you can get the same idea, right? So top of the backswing into that cup position, bring the club down, maintaining that cup position until it's down on the ground. Now put your left hand on below, maintaining that cup position. You can see now I've got my eyes over the ball. My shoulders, the great thing about this grip is that the shoulders stay very, very square and back and through the shoulders will just rock back and through and you can see how nice and square that putter face stays on the way to the hole no opening no closing and that putter is going to knock that ball in the hole over and over again try this on your carpet at home get comfortable with it and then take it to the course and lower your scores